Hello and welcome to the Void XRC video. Thanks for tuning in. So, the snow is finally gone and yesterday I took this thing down to the park to get a test run and see what it was like after all the modifications. And when I first got, <coughs> excuse me, when I first got there, it seemed to be driving completely fine. But when I got to the spot where I was actually going to film, the steering just sort of gave up. Now, let me just show you what I mean here. I'll turn it on and, and we'll see. get these lights from stop flash in here make it a little easier to see all right I'll show you what happened to the steering as you can see it's gone to shit so I'm gonna have to get in there figure out what the problem is one other thing I did notice is there was, I was also getting a little bit of slip on the slipper clutch so I'm probably going to have to get into there too and I think some oil has got onto the slipper clutch and that's why it's slipping so easily. Anyways, I'm going to do a jump cut and get back to you guys when I've got some of the stuff off the vehicle. Alright, well it took me a little bit to get everything off and get down to here. Let's have another look at the steering. As you can see, it really seems to be struggling. However, if I give it just a little bit of help, it does turn fine. And I can't actually feel anything catching it. And it will work fine after I've helped a bit, but then it goes back to getting stuck again. Or at least it was. Well, it seems to be working at the moment. Whether it will continue to work and what the actual problem is, I'm still not sure. And I would like to investigate it a little bit more to figure out actually what it was or what it is. Alright, so I think the problem was the aluminum was binding in there. I put some white, lithi white lithium grease in there and it is much smoother now. So hopefully that fixes it. Now it's time to have a look at the slipper clutch and see if that needs to some work on it. Alright, I just finally got the slipper clutch out and you can see how greased up they were. It's no wonder I was having some pretty serious slip. Let's get these cleaned up with some paper towel. I've got most of the oil and grease wiped up. You can see there's a good amount of wear on here though. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to sand this down, sand down the plate a bit, and hopefully that'll give me enough traction. Hopefully this pad is now in good enough condition to give me some better grip. Alright, I basically got everything back together. Got all my lights working again. Tail lights too. I did knock one of the wires off 
for the winch, so I'll have to re-solder that. And I'll have to re-put the body back on. But that's not really a big deal. I've got the steering back to normal, it seems. As you can see, and I've also did a little bit of work on the slipper clutch, getting rid of all the grease and stuff that was on it, and sanding it down a bit to give me a bit more grip, so I have that done now too. So now the next video with this will again be my first running after I've done all the modifications. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks again, and I'll see you guys next time.